Uh, on behalf of MCC, a very warm welcome to all of you to celebrate 150 years of Japanese cricket. This is a tour for the Japanese men and women's national teams. Um, it's in commemoration of the, of the first ever cricket match played in Japan 150 years ago. And uh, it's also an opportunity to get the Japanese community in London involved. Uh, we've got quite a few people here today. Some say it's uh, closing around 1,500 spectators. A really important part of our role is a glo global outreach. We're really keen to encourage cricket played all over the world, particularly in developing uh, countries cricket-wise. And uh, examples of that are our work in Afghanistan and uh, Sri Lanka, the Foundation of Goodness in Sri Lanka that I've been to, it's an absolutely amazing place. And similarly with, with, with Japan, they're making their way in international cricket. Their women's team, who of course play here on Monday, are uh, doing really well. They've been in Zimbabwe recently. And we believe there's an awful lot that we can do uh, to help that development by hosting matches such as this here at Lords. Of course, when we Japanese study English at school, we inevitably encounter the expression, it's not cricket and are taught about the almost peculiar importance British people attach to the sport as well as to sportsmanship and fair play involved. I had looked forward to today's event as it would provide me with a golden opportunity to learn what is cricket in addition to what is not and to get a little closer to figuring out why the sound of leather on willow is so magical to the British people. Every year we host around 46 matches on the nursery ground here. It's used for practice on many other days as well during the summer, of the vast majority of days actually for Middlesex, for the young cricketers here and also of course for the international sides when they come to play at Lords. So it's absolutely crucial and it's crucial we maintain the, the size of the nursery ground too. We can see today it's, uh, you need the, as big a boundaries as you, as you possibly can do. And uh, with the size that we have now we can stage high quality matches which is just what we're doing today with the match against Japan.